Hey everyone! So, if you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen a really cool reel I put out a couple of weeks ago talking about how I committed to curating my apartment in the most sustainable way possible, which meant getting a lot of secondhand pieces. There is an incredible adventure um, that goes behind the story of how this couch wound up being with me today. And it started with an offer up deal and an amazing human being named Fish. And part one of the adventure took about three hours of moving and shaking and taking doors off hinges and taking pieces of the couch off just to get it out of the apartment complex. And we thought that would be the most difficult and entertaining part of the story. But lo and behold, whenever Fish and I think of conquering the world together, it never goes as planned. And so here we are without further ado, the rest of the adventure of how we got this beautiful couch successfully into my apartment. Check it out. Jazz. I love our adventures. I missed I missed us. <laughs> Literally us. Literally. Why though? But a lot of love has been shared. Five minutes later. I just had the best idea of the night. This is also why she brings me everywhere. We almost drove off and drop off this van we rented with the sofa in the van still. But then we realized we'd have to drive back. So we just had the great idea to now take it out. Take the sofa out. That's all. I'm plugging in the address. Back that baby up! What's your car's name? The Bullet. <laughs> <laughs> My college roommate named it because it looks like the Bullet in Mario Kart. Mama, we made it. And Madison's come to help. The beachfront property in Arizona is what you did, Daddy. Are the stairs an option? That door looks pretty narrow. I don't know what's... Which... Is well, with a skateboard, I do prefer the longer walk with less stairs. <laughs> One hour later. The couch has made it. We didn't show any of it happening because we needed all six hands and limbs. We thought we were done. But then I. Jazz. And now we have to go get the keys. But she still has smiles somehow. Always. We're smiling. It'll be a good story in like a week. Hell yeah. Maybe tomorrow afternoon. Yeah, tomorrow after we sleep. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a call. Once you are back on the vehicle, I will unlock it. <gasps> Thank you so much. Yes, we back in the car. One step closer to the keys to sleep. <laughs> <My forearm. laughs> A lot of boring math later. Still no key. Six. It's one. Six hour adventure to get a couch. Never agree to do anything with me again. Always agree to do things with jazz. <laughs> ginger chews on ginger chews. On ginger chews. So you use these for game day because I get really bad game stomach. Also because of nerves. How many do you eat in a day? Just two. When? Pre game, half time. Really? Mm -hmm. That's such a good hack. Yeah, it works like a charm. All cuddled up. And the new re ink blankie. Every one of our, our players got a gift from Kristen. Her new blankie. And I get to cuddle with it tonight. 
See you in the AM. Yes, we'll figure out the keys then. Good night. Oh wow, that was perfect timing. The following day. I'm still here. Lando is also still here. We'll come back for you, Lando. The locksmith was gonna be like $400. And that's ridiculous. So I'm gonna Uber home 40 minutes, grab my spare key, and then Uber back, which will probably still be cheaper. Wish me luck. What a day. A mix of days. We've got keys. Let's make sure it's turned on. Oh, I can leave now. Let's get smarter, Megan. I just called myself Megan. That's where we're at. Thanks for joining. It's been another fun fishing kicks.